welcome to my channel. It is day 23 of Vlogmas. Um, so a few of you had asked if I would share the uh, hamper that I've got for my mum. So I'm going to go through all the details like of everything with you um, and what I'm putting in the hamper. And I have my apprentice here, <laughs> Sydney, he wanted to join us. So um, first of all, this is the hamper. <laughs> so it's actually a box that comes at work um, which delivers the meat. <laughs> Um, obviously the packaged meat, but they all come in boxes like this, packs of four, meats, or whatever it is, mince, chicken, whatever, and yeah, they were going spare, so I grabbed a few, and I thought this would actually be perfect for my mum's hamper. So what's Cindy going to do tomorrow, he's actually going to decorate this for me, um, and then what I'll do is I will wrap it so mum has something to open, um, and then she'll, she can keep the box as well Mommy, if she wants to. but we don't have any gold. It doesn't matter, you can I, do whatever you I want. Used to have some. Oh, we might have some paint or something. You could paint it because uh, we've probably still got time for it to dry um, or just, just decorate it however we want to. So, I use glitter. we could use glitter. We're going to use glitter, yeah? Right, so first up, um, I've basically got some different things. So last year we did like more of a foodie hamper. Um, this year I've kind of gone a bit different. I've got a few foodie bits, but also some clothing and things like that. So first up, I've got this beautiful, and it's so soft, isn't it, Sydney? Yeah. So soft. It's, it's going to be really hard to show you, but it's like a hoodie. It's got, like, I don't know if you can see, it's got a star print on it. It's got um, on the back. It's so soft, um, just like a loungewear top. It's from um, Next, and it was... I think it was £18 and I must take the price label out. <laughs> um, not that my mum would care but no one will see the prices do they at Christmas. So yes, that's my mum. It's got like a little pocket in there as well. Um, it's just like basically lounging in the evenings when it's cold but you don't really want to wear your dressing gown that as yet. So that's going to go in there. Next up we have these... Yes. S uh, s slipper socks so these are from Primark and are they soft Sydney? really soft really uh, soft they're softer than that are they? so it's sort of like uh, fake fur inside not f like sheepskin fur um, that sort of fakeness fake that fake sheepskin fur inside um, it's got like a little stripe on it these were a bargain. I haven't got the price on here, but they were £2.50. Um, absolute bargain. Um, so they've got like a little bow detail as well. Unfortunately, they don't match the top that I got because I bought them at separate times. Um, but it won't matter, will it? It won't matter. So they'll be going in the box. So next up, we have the coffee cup. This is a plastic coffee mug. It was £2 from Primark. I mean, the home collections. Um, they had different designs, but this is the one that I thought was probably best for my mum. They did have some others, and I wish I'd got picked them up, um, which were like more floral, which I think my mum would have liked. But she'll like this, I know she will. Um, and yeah, it's basically because if you go to Waitrose now, um, if you've got a Waitrose card, you can get a free coffee. Well, they've stopped using the, the normal cups, um, and mum wanted a uh, plastic one, to, so it's nice and light. She has quite a biggish bag that she can pop in her bag. So when she's out, she's got it there. Um, she has got one, but I think it's a China one. Um, and it was just going to be too heavy. So she wanted to get a plastic one. And so I thought I'd pick one up for her. So that's going to go in there as well. Next up we have... We have a bottle of gin. Now I picked these up in Sainsbury's. They were an offer. I think they were £3 each. And this is a uh, Whitley Neal handcrafted gin, rhubarb and ginger gin. Mum likes gin. Um, so she just likes them now and again. But I just thought they're nice to get some little different flavour um, for her to try. So that will be going in there as well. And then we also have another one, which is Sip Smith. And it's a slow gin. Now, I've had this one before myself um, when I've been out and about. And it's really nice. It's actually really wintry. And it's great with a slice of lemon in it with, like, some tonic water um, and a slice of lemon. It's it's kind of like 
a gin alternative to like mauled wine. It's like a Christmas drink, I would say. So yeah, I think she'll like that one as well. Um, these are buttermilk, um, or is the make, I presume. Artisan con confectionery, mince pie fudge. I know mum loves fudge. So um, I saw these, these are actually from work. Um, it's just like a little independent shop, but I think I probably, I think I have seen them around. You probably can get them like more in like farm shops and places like that. Um, I can't remember how much they were. I think they were like two forty-five or two ninety-five from work. Um, but just something a little bit different, and I thought it was quite Christmassy. And then next up we have chili jam. Now this has been made by myself. Um, if anyone wants me to do a video on this chili jam, it's not slimming well related, but it's only what, half a in a teaspoon. It's going to be no different to normal jam. Um, I bought these jars from Wilco's. They were £3 each, but they do have like a massive pack of, I think I've got like 12 jars um, for £5. But I wanted to get these ones just for my mum. The others I've done for gifts for other people. Um, but you can write on the top of them. Someone did rub it off to have a look at it um but yes yeah, so i'll rewrite that but yeah you can write on it and then so she can use it again and put whatever she wants in there um but yeah if anyone's interested in me to do a recipe on it um it's so simple to make and i we've made some for ourselves and it's really really nice so we'll definitely be having this again um be making it's so easy to make i'll be making it all the time i think um so that's going to go in there next up we have these are from Sarah's Creative Kitchens. They, I can't remember how much they were. Maybe one ninety-five. I can't remember. Or maybe I can't remember now. Um, they are three sins each. Um, and then they got little Rudolphs on them. And I know Mum likes dark chocolate, so I thought I would get those for her. Do you like that? You like dark chocolate as well, don't you? Um, I also have got these, which I made these again myself. This is like a mint, um, I don't know what you call it, like mint snap. It's so simple. It's basically sugar, um, I can't remember the sugar it was, Demira sugar, I think. I'll have to check. Um, peppermint and just dark chocolate. And yeah, it, you just make it. <laughs> and then you put it in the fridge. When it goes really hard, you snap it. And make like little pieces if you can see that um so yeah that was just really simple to make again if anyone wants me to do a video i could probably do them a video with both of them together but um i just thought they're really nice little gifts for christmas um and we put some of those in the teachers um bags as well um we've also got here astral original my mum uses this i use this it's a really good moisturizer and it was an offer i I think I bought this in Wilkin Wilkinson's for £2. They also had it in Super Dragon as well on offer. Um, but yeah, so I thought I'd get this to pop in there as well because I know Mum uses that one. And last but not least are these little wax melts. I actually made these myself. Um, I bought a pack um, online. It's so simple to make. Um, it's lime, basil and mandarin. Um, I literally made these this evening. Um, yeah, and Sydney did the label. I don't know if you can see it. So yeah, I put hand by mine myself because <laughs> just in case she doesn't like the smell, but I think she does because I bought um, from other brands before. But yeah, they're little stars. There's, I don't know if you can see them. Um, if you use wax melts, they are just yeah, they're exactly the same as those. So so simple to make, and. Um, She's, I know she's got an oil burner because I bought one for her and she uses it all the time. So, um, yeah, they're going to go in there as well. Mm, they smell nice. They smell nice. Do you like them? Uh, smell? Yeah. So, that is my mum's hamper. That's going to be, um, or the box is going to be decorated tonight and it will be uh, packed and ready for her for Christmas Day. It's not going to be packed tonight. Till tonight. Oh, not tonight tomorrow tomorrow you're gonna yeah. paint it or do whatever and then i'll wrap it tomorrow night ready for her on christmas day so that's all is that all yeah yeah so what do we say sydney bye
Thank you for watching. Please. Give a thumbs up. <laughs> Take care. Take care. And have a fab day. Have a fab day. Thank <laughs> you for watching. Bye.